you know, being kicked out. I'll talk about it more. This is what all my stuff looks like. A fat, a fat, a fat. Everyone is staying at me on this machine. So drop it a thumbs up for your boy. Because I don't care, but I care about you guys. This is what all my stuff looks like. I'm busy organizing it all. Yeah, this is stressful, but let me get done with this quickly. Guys, I'm stressed. I'm packing up. We're being kicked out. I'll talk about it more. Always a smile on my face because I always keep it positive, but I'm going to pack my stuff out. I'm going to be gone. Um, let me pack up because time's running against me, and then I'll explain to you in a bit. All my Gymshark stuff, what I can quickly pack now and there is the stabilizer that I recently got film for my people for my fam extra hoodie the apex hoodie from Gymshark just in case put that in there okay, let me explain so it was like really rushed but we got kicked out the apartment I'm gonna go back after some time this is what happened I haven't told you guys what's been happening because I didn't think it was gonna be a thing but the owners of the apartment were like, hey, we just want to come and evaluate the place, da da da. And I was like, ah, no worries, you know. But we were already thinking like, yo, if they want to evaluate, we need to be smart. They might want to get, like, sell the place. Lo and behold, they are selling the place. They are now having viewing, which means I had to get out. Inconvenient, but that's fine. That allows me to go and record a dope vlog for you guys. So we're gonna train, we're gonna go out, we're gonna do shopping, I'm just gonna do a bunch of dope stuff. So, and that also allows us to find a new place, like a whole new story. Guys, let's get off with the video. Smash the thumbs up button, it's your boy Mike Diamonds. Guys, look at what Russia's looking like. I'm gonna go visit my boys on campus, I haven't seen them in a while, but let's do it. I did that when I did my dirty bowl. But I'm gonna show you the diet that helps you get the cheapest diet for bodybuilding. It, if you're broke or you're just trying to save money, I'm gonna tell you all my tips and tricks that allow me to save money and make my gains. Or if I need to shred down as a student, this is what's allowed me to be able to sustain this lifestyle. So we're about to head to spa and I'm gonna give you all my gains, all my tips. All my game and all my tricks in terms of saving money and building muscle. Everyone is staring at me on this machine. So drop it a thumbs up for your boy because I don't care, but I care about you guys. So let's go into spot. See, too expensive, don't buy it. Tip number two, always buy the store's brand. So like this is like the store that I'm shopping Zeph's brand. The water, it's the cheapest. It always will be. There's no like water's all the same thing as this brand. So buy the store's brand. Tip number three, I go and buy my proteins first. So just show them there. See here is like brand owned like protein sources but always buy your gains your proteins from the butchery so i'm gonna get here and they're always cheaper the butchery will always be cheaper to buy your gains and also the food is rather more fresh compared to the ones that have been stored and have preservatives in them so it's cheaper and it's like fresher in terms of getting your protein sources
So my sources of protein is always going to be chicken breast because it's the cheapest, buying at the butchery, and my second source of protein is always going to be ground beef, very lean ground beef. Now, that is all my protein sources that I buy. In terms of carbs, very simple bodybuilding stuff, I buy oats. And as you guys can see, I also got some rice, which has a discount. So you look for like the little tags at any shop that you have, and this rice is cheaper than the others. And for my other source of carbs, in terms of veggies, so I can get my micros, I always buy frozen vegetables instead of fresh ones, because it's more expensive. So frozen vegetables, it will also help you bulk up your meals. If you have a sweet tooth, don't carry a lot of this stuff around. If you're dieting, shredding down, this can be detrimental. So foods that you know you're gonna overeat in, or like that will ruin your diet, don't buy a lot or don't buy them at all. Don't keep them in your house and that will help you stay on track with your diet. Almost done. What are you doing, bro? Cringe level is 9,000 right now, bro. Everyone is just staring at me coming up. <laughs> Guys, that was so awkward. Drop a thumbs up for your boy. Also for this mini shoulder pump I'm getting from holding all this back. <laughs> so, these are my main bodybuilding bulky meals. This will minimum last me a week maximum a week and a half. I might buy some stuff here and there, but let's run through it right quick. Protein sources. Tip number one, buy from the butchery. So I bought my lean ground chicken breasts, which was very cheap, and my lean ground beef. These are my whole foods in terms of my protein sources. To get yourself from my protein, the whey protein as well, link in the description, Team Diamonds for 20% off. I promise you this will save you money. Let's talk about carbs. This was on discount, so you look for the little tags in the store for discounts. The rice is also the main like bulky meal for me, so this will also keep it on discount. I will have mixed veg for my micronutrients, so I can still get veg in. Buying salads and stuff can typically be more expensive, but I like buying the frozen veggies because this is also low in carb. And then I have rice cakes, which are very cheap for my sweet tooth. Some Oreos. If you're shredding down like and you're low on macros, this maybe will not fit. I got some beans, I got some sauce for the rice in the mixture. I have low calorie fat, I mean low fat milk. And check this out, I also got sushi. That's if you're lean bulking, this is low fat, so like the carbs will do me good. And then I'll tell you guys the whole price of everything. Tops, just show them quickly. In the price, I bought some like household things like mouthwash and whatever, which is included. So take this into consideration. The bill, 1,443 Russian rubles, which is $42. So probably less than 40 bucks that I spent. And that is 36 euros and 32 pounds. If you're in Namibia or South Africa, that is 580 Namibian dollars or rands. If you guys enjoyed that, I hope it was informative. Drop it a thumbs up if you did. But me and Taps, Gonna eat sushi, right? Yeah, sushi. That's cool. Yeah. We're about to head out, rocking a scoop neck, the Legend London jeans, and the Ultra Boosts. I am so hungry. I haven't eaten today, so let's go. I'm at the mall now with the boys. I am so hungry, bro. My G7X broke, bro. My other one broke, bro. Oh shit! I know, sad story, bro. I don't want to talk about it now. I'm gonna end the video right there, guys. If you want to like, want me to like record me going out, like more lifestyle stuff, let me know in the comment section. Comment down below any of your thoughts of the videos you guys want to see in the future. If you enjoyed the video, and if actually you want to see like the rest of the night, which I did film, smash it with a thumbs up. But I hope you guys enjoyed the whole grocery bulking diet. If you have any tips and tricks that you guys think that I should add to my dad or whatever, anything that you may be doing, comment down below. And I'm gonna sign off here guys. If you haven't seen the previous video, this is it right here. This is another video right here, which is also dope. And subscribe to the channel with this little button. If you haven't, I'll see you guys in the next one.